Yeah, lots happened in the last episode. Damn. Chapter 7, guys. Damn. Wake up. Mike, is that you? Shh. What? Get over it. Then she's, she's realised, but she's sort of gagged to a chair there, mate. I'm tipped over. No, in our lock. Go away, there is no network error. Let me take head. We're back. Technical issues. Uh, difficulties? Technical issues and all that. She's not having a good time, is she? She wanted a bath, bless her. Glad you found me. It's okay. Needs another one now. You okay? Where? Where's Jessica? She's she's not with you. She did. Jessica's dead. What? He killed her, Sam. There's some maniac on the mountain who was trying to kill us, all of us, and I swear to God, when everyone is safe and accounted for, I am gonna hunt that fucker down and rip his nuts off one at a goddamn time. Whoa. Listen, this guy who you're talking about, he attacked me. He showed me these videos, too. And one of them showed Josh being killed, just ripped apart by this huge fucking saw blade. Jesus Christ, what the fuck is going on around here? There's a door here. It won't open. Can you unlock it from your side? Yeah, I don't know. Can I put some clothes on first? Oh, he's watching me. Oh boy. He knows. And if you've been watching my previous episodes, you know that I like to sort of look around for the totem pole clues, so I know what to sort of do in the next sort of situations. Uh, as you can see, there's fuck all else here to do except for open the door and get the bag off it. So he didn't give any clothes, just a torch. That's nice of him. What's your favourite brand alpaca there? I bet we've all got an alpaca backpack, right? If not, you're missing out. It's like ball boy shoes. Yeah, not sure what we were trying to achieve there. And the door is open. Hey. Can I have your jacket, please? I'm a bit naked. Yes, you too. Way too casually just walking around with just a towel on. It's not what are you doing? Well, actually, the towel didn't turn out to be the best outfit for fighting off killer maniacs, you know. Do you mind? Mike. Oh, uh, right. My bad. I need a wolf for quickest costume change goes to. Okay, done. Let's get the scene of it. I'm into that. No, 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 get away! 
Wow, all the guys are getting on it. What a treat. Oh, Chris. Just in time to see him be cut to death. Oh, Chris, 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 Chris. What the fuck? But you've heard of blanks before. I mean, really? Oh, it's a psychotic Josh. Back from the dead. Well, he wasn't dead, obviously. Spoiler. Oh, she's oh, alive. Oh, oh thank God. 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 Oh, oh, I lost Emily. This is going well. Shit. Emily's still alive. Oh, shit. I don't see for long. She doesn't look in the best of positions. Yes. <sighs> Come on, Emily. You can do this. I believe in you. Types of fucking wrong written all over it. Come on, Emily. Grab it. <laughs> yes, my girl, that's the one. Oh dear, there's something that's gonna break in a minute. Stitch, short in time for more story time. Emily, believe it or not, is still alive. She was here earlier on. But it doesn't look well for her. Don't tease me with the prospect of Emily being alive and then snatch it away from me. Just straight away. Oh god, we've broken our ankle. Oh god. Oh my days, Emily. How many lives have you got? You beautiful beautiful thing, you're still alive and actually probably going to get shoved off the edge. Oh, she's still going. That's it, you star, come on. Oh, God. Here goes 600 bucks. Better be worth it or the great in that top. What's she doing? Alright. Now we're talking. Oh, she's like a genius. I can't believe Emily's still alive. I mean, she was in the tower and it like cascaded down into the mines. And lo and behold, the superstar is still here. I've never been so happy. I mean, ideally, don't start shouting because we'll give our attention away, even though you are. I've got a massive fucking beacon as a light there, but I'm going to be really good if Emily dies. Just as much as I was going, I thought I actually died earlier on, but it's going well. Uh, oh, fuck me, I thought it was a massive drop. I thought we just walked straight off an edge. I fucking killed her. After all that, she just walks off the edge. I mean, Matt, how many people are still alive? Matt's still alive. Sam's still alive. Ashley's still alive. Chris is still alive. Emily's still alive. We are doing all right, actually. This is not bad. Who has died? Just Jess. Success, if you ask me. Let's go and look up this way for a totem pole. We really need some clues. Need all the help I can get. This mine thing is going to come right down on my face. Maybe... Maybe move out the way before you turn it on. I guess that will open the door down the bottom. Oh, what's this? Apologies again if people don't like uh, people like looking around for like the stuff to help me, but I have to uh, to get all the help I can for these guys to survive. Absolutely over the moon though that Emily is still still rocking. What a superstar she is. My opinion on her changed a lot. I mean, episode one I didn't like her. Now she is my girl. Uh, be careful. Quietly does 
message with the hydrate, greatly appreciated. I'm on the hard stuff there, I'm on the water. What are you doing? Don't start burning the fucking mine down. Uh, no, I'm not ready for that yet. I, <laughs> I mean, we've been everywhere else, so I suppose I should just go that way. But I mean, there's got to be a totem pole around here somewhere. There hasn't been one in ages. it would be. I mean if anyone wants to place their bets on who's gonna die next, feel free. Oh there's a clocking in machine. Clues, clock I mean none of these clues are making any sense to be in out thirty six. Place is falling apart. All well, things are blowing up. Either way, we need to um, we need to get out of here. Could we go up this ladder? Yes, we can. I mean, I wouldn't trust the lift. So let's go to Safeway and up a nice, nice, sturdy ladder. Come on, Emily, you've got this. Come on. Oh, fuck. No, 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 no. Oh, God! Oh, did I really just say nice, sturdy ladder? And then it just snapped on her. This game is a fucking curse. This game does not like me. Oh, great. Now we've got to go. Oh, Jesus. Emily, it's fine. It's all oh, fine, God. Emily. I mean, probably shouldn't listen to me because I said no sturdy ladder and it broke, so everything I say is just absolute fucking shit. Blatant lies. Just pretty much in the dark down here. Oh my gosh. I don't think that's Matt. Are you really going to try and... Oh, that was that was a lot weaker than I expected it to be. Okay, that's uh, there's a little there's a thing down here. There's a thing. That's a thing. Weird. That's really weird. I don't know what it is, but it's a thing. If anyone knows what that thing is, clues on a postcard. But... I have no idea what the fuck that was. Are we really going into a dark, dank cave? Ooh, it's a clue. It's a lunchbox. Oh, it's a toolbox. Hmm. Hmm. Here is Billy. Are we home safely? Your loving wife and daughter. Something can Louise. Oh, there we go. I guess he never made it home safe. I mean, I'm looking for totem poles to help me. We found a toolbox and some weird crappy thing on the floor. What's this down here? Something else is shining. I mean, you don't tell me what any of this is. It's just, oh, look at this. What is it? Doesn't matter. Oh, I think we play it safe by climbing. Oh god, not not this fucking reaction thing again. These guys are just triathletes, aren't they, with their climbing skills? Oh, fuck me, that was close. I almost missed that one. I'm doing everything in my power to keep Emily safe. But I don't trust these ladders after the last one. If 
I was having the old one, so I should have had her again. I fucking last one made her just fall straight on her head. Jesus, he's not having a good day. And I'm not going to fall off a cliff now. I'm going this way looking for stuff. Nervous sense of dread walking through these caves with Emily. Something bad is going to happen to her. To seriously reevaluate my life if Emily dies. <laughs> I don't think he's there. Shit, careful where you're walking. Emily's great day goes from bad to worse. <laughs> ah, nice. So he knows that my uh, battery's run out, so he's just set some lovely uh, pyro off on me. Are we gone full circle or is there someone else's flaming torch? I mean, I guess someone else's. Okay, Emily, if you insist, we'll pull the switch. Oh my god, finally something worked! Oh, so I couldn't just lift anyway, I had to do all of that because the lift power didn't work. It wasn't a wasted journey, guys. It was just a long-winded one because the ladder broke and we ended up falling all the way down a massive hole. Poor bastard. Excuse my language. I do apologise. I'll try and I'll try and uh, cut that out. There's a link for our YouTube channel. We just passed 50 subs yesterday, so we're absolutely buzzing about that one. Thank you, guys. For subscribing and supporting us on our little business venture. I say this game will be up on uh, uh, throughout the next couple of weeks in installments. Well, finally a totem pole. Here we go. What clue ought this be? Ooh, a hand coming out of the wall. Spoiler. I mean, I did mention earlier on that there was a corridor where Han should come out the wall a la Resident Evil style. Stick to the right hand side then, is that what I'm saying? None of this is making... I mean, look, let's just go look. Look at this, but you can't do anything with it. These characters just like shouting out their person's name that they were with in hope, in sheer desperation that maybe he might be still around. Oh, yes. Yes. Why are you not climbing with a year? Shit. There ain't no way you're climbing up that without a climbing spike in the correct shoes. Conveniently, I don't think none of them are lying around for you. Oh. <sighs> Lovely. Danger is my middle fucking name. Gur Edge. Let's set some steps. I don't think he is, is it? Oh, there they. Some spectacles. Yeah, no. It's been a year. Surely, uh, Hannah's glasses would not still be lying down on the shaft. 
That's when the police were supposed to have checked all this. And greatly appreciated. No, this is not a good idea. When we're best now. That's exactly a year ago. What does this mean? What does that mean? But as I say, thank you, Stitch. Greatly appreciated for the follow. Join in the numbers. So check out the uh, content on that. While Sony and his film reviews is quite decent. A lot of editing from uh, our chief there, uh, Foxy Stokes. Fatter. <laughs> Christ, oh, this Jesus. is a rather grim find down here. I'm guessing Beth died then. A year ago today. There's some tension music, shit's about to go down, that's all I know. I should apologise if I get any like uh, shouting or like loud. Oh, we found the uh, whatever the fuck that is. It's Hannah's locket, I think. Oh, she was down here. Yeah, all my Tomb Raider videos are up on there. Um, in fact, there's a lot of GTA content. He's done the Bird Dead 2 on there as well, so you don't need to play the game, you can just watch that, watch the game back and enjoy. Thanks for telling me which way I need to go with the flashing light. I mean, I thought we were looking for the lift shaft so we could go up and get out of here. We just seem to be gallivanting around in the caves now, having a little jaunt for detective clues. Let's lift that way, that's beautiful. That's the way we need to go. One second while I just look this way. I mean, Emily looks knackered. Bless her, she's not having a good day. What is this? Yeah. Ah! Oh, nice. Oh god! Oh god, Oh god, no. We We found Beth, everybody. We did a better job than the police instantly. They didn't really look down in these mine shafts. I didn't find any mates. Rotted head down in the mine shafts just by sheer luck. That's, that's been there a year. Oh, there you go. Is so the clock in the machine? I've already looked at this. Okay, we can leave that alone. To the to the left we go. Let's get the fuck out of here. Get back to the lodge. Get the kettle on. Have a nice cup of tea and wait for it all to blow over. Christ, we're going up. No! Oh no. I'm about to die. Oh, you prick. No, no, no. Please don't kill Emily. No, 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 no. Run, Emily, run. Run, you beautiful bitch, run! No. Oh my god, stop with the quick reaction things, I'm gonna die! Don't stand there and wait for him. Oh, we're gonna burn, we're gonna set ourselves on fire. You did not think that through, Emily. You did not think that through at all. You 
never hide, they'll find you. Oh, he's running straight back to us. Oh, that was a mistake. We're dead. We're, unless that fire explodes now and takes him out. Why was this loud explosion? I literally fucked up, it said don't move and I moved the controller straight away to put it on my leg to not move it. And after all you've been oh through, Emily, I'm so good, sorry. Good, good, good. I mean how does that feel? Right? How does it feel? Do you enjoy feeling terrorized, humiliated? I mean panicked? All those emotions that my sisters got to feel once one year ago? Only, only guess what? They didn't get to laugh it off. No! No, 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 no! They're gone! I don't know if you noticed this, Josh, but none of us are laughing. Oh, come, 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 come. Why the long faces? Come on. It's good to get the heart racing every now and then, right? And race, they did. I mean, every one of you just pitter pat, pitter pat. I hope you appreciated my little phantasmagorical spectacle. I mean, <gasps> no detail too small. That just no happened. opportunity missed. It was such. A delight to play the puppet master to, to all of your Pavlovian panic. <laughs> all that gore, gore, it was gore galore, fake bodies. I mean, God, that shit was expensive. And no retakes. Nope, nope, nope. Only double takes. Oh, you should have seen your faces. Hook, line, and sinker for every little stinker. <laughs> Josh, why are you doing this? Yeah, don't even ask this squirrely little runt. He's got no clue. He's out of his fucking tree. He's definitely off his meds. Oh, come on, you guys. Revenge is the best medicine. You're done. Hey, Mike, he's sick. What? Come on, you guys are all gonna thank me when you guys become internet sensations. Wait, what? what? Oh, you better believe this little puppy's going viral, ladies and germs. I mean, we got unrequited love. We got, we got blood. I don't think there's enough hard drives in China to, to count all the views we're gonna get, you guys. What are you talking about, you asshat? Jessica's fucking dead! What? Did you hear me? Jessica is dead. You are gonna fucking pay, you ah! bitch! Ah! What a nice. We found this taking a turn, isn't it? Seriously, this is crazy, you know? Shut up. Why'd you hit her, man? Huh? Why'd you the fucking hit her? Ah! What are you talking you about? You punched Ashley, you piece of shit! Mm. Oh. I got so mad. You don't hit a girl. You, you just don't. Dude, dude, Chris. Bro, I... And I'm not your bro. Where are we going? Where are you guys taking me? Locking you up, bro. What? You can't do anything stupid before we call the police in the morning. Come on. I didn't do anything. Are, are you serious, bro? Goddamn murderer is what you are. Uh, I didn't do it. Michael, please, just listen to me, man. I did not hurt Jessica. You know what, man? You need to shut up. Chris, hey, come on, Coach. He's, we're partners. Stop. Don't say that. Oh, fine. Be a dick. Not really winning many friends, this Josh, is he? Why are we taking him to the whipping shed? You see what you want to see. You're Stop talking. I, you are... Ah, dude. Ah, it's not my fault you suckers can't take a joke. Uh, oh. What a hilarious joke. Did it hurt you? Did you just you feel a little, a little bit of pain? Mm. Right now, I'm so, so ah! sorry! Stop it! Jesus, it's stop! Oh, Michael, I'm sorry, man. I can't tell you how sorry I am that something happened to Jessica, but I swear, I swear to you, I have no idea what happened to her. Shut the fuck up, Josh. You can't talk your way out of this one. Okay, I'm gonna all just get along. It's mentally ah. broken. Damn it! 
not dicking around. What are we doing to the poor lad? Convenient, nice little stall. Okay, time me up now, okay. Stay still, right, man. Right, 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 still. Okay, can time up if they just wiggle around. Gosh, dude. I leave me a little wiggle room, huh? What does it take to shut you up? Oh, not so tight, okay? Not so tight, okay. Splash the ties, that's where it's at. In God's name, what is he talking about? This is hard to watch. You ever see this kind of shit before? Ladies and gentlemen, when we broke Josh, he's not dealt with the death of his sisters since last year or all, and his vengeance plan has gone tits up. I'm sorry, what did you say? Mentally unstable is the word. I never imagined in my wildest dreams that you liked me. Stop. Mm, 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 mm. You know what that sound is? It's the sound of never kissing Ashley, you pussy! Stop! Yeah, you know, you might as well let Ashley sleep with Mike. I mean, at least he's got some notches in his belt, you know? He'll treat her right! You're fucking pathetic, Christopher! I'm gonna beat his head off. Don't listen to him. Not worth it. Hey, Mike. Hey, Mike, 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 Mike. Mike. What? What happened with Jess, Mike? You know what happened. No. No, I... I don't. I got a problem, Mike. I don't remember killing Jess. Christ. No, I mean, like, I feel like I, I would remember killing her, you know? She's... I don't even think it was Josh who killed got, him. Like, a really yes. tight bod. Shut your fucking mouth! No! Seriously? What? what? Did you think I was gonna shoot him? I... No, no. Come on, Chris. You know me better than that. Yeah, Chris. You know me better than that. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Well, just next time, give me a heads up, all right? <gasps> oh, you poor little piggies. You can't even get your good cop, bad cop routine to work. Leave us to the pros, bros. Why don't you go back to the lodge? Make sure everything's all right. I'll stay here with this lunatic until the morning. Oh, sleep over. <laughs> Can we order pizza? You sure you're okay? Yeah. They want to know everything's fine back there. Yeah, you're right. See you in the morning. We were leaving them two in the barn overnight. Chapter done. One more to go. Josh! <laughs> <laughs> Josh! How does it feel? Do you enjoy all those emotions that my sisters got to feel once, one year ago? Only, only guess what? They didn't get to laugh it off. No! Nope! No, no, no! They're gone! Jessica's fucking dead! What? Did you hear me? Jessica is dead. And you were gonna fucking pay, you ah! dick! What happened with Jess, Mike? I don't remember killing Jess. Christ. Oh, God. Oh, my God, Matt. <laughs> hmm? 
Ashley Martin, like he might not kill her. No! Don't do it! Tell her to be quiet, she keeps shouting. Emily, just listen to him. No! 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 <laughs> Just when we thought we got out of the mine shaft, we shoved straight back in. What? Oh shit! Oh shit! We're never getting out of this mine. Oh, but Emily's fucking alive. Get in. Shit! What we got? Flares. Probably don't lose them all at once. I think that's a ward off the weird little fucking people. Oh, it's deja vu. Here we go again with Emily in the fucking mine shafts. It's this chapter all over again. I swear we've looked at this one, but just in case. I might can't go through shooting something at some point. I mean, if we're lucky, we might find Jess. Or did we find Jess? Some cute. No, we haven't found Jess. We might find Jess, people. She might still be alive down here. We could all end up getting out of this alive. It's a long shot, but I'm optimistic. Okay. Okay, this is going to uh, be the No, way. Emily, don't go through the gap. No, no, Emily. <laughs> Shit! Me. The flare's meant to ward the person off, Emily. I think it's. Throw it at him. If we just run deeper into the fucking underground. Oh, here we go again. We're gonna get caught in the thing by the little fucking thing, aren't we? Please, for the love of God, let Emily survive. We've been for enough now. Hello. I've done it again! You fucking knuckle! Absolute ass map! Every time it says don't move, I fucking move straight away! Man, Emily to the rescue! Oh my days, what are we doing now? It's a fucking trash compactor, isn't it? Oh god! Leap off. Oh. Probably saying that's a fucking compactor. Never been so invested in keeping someone alive since I got a fucking Tamagotchi. Yeah, shut it! Shut it! Oh. Fucking hell, Emily. Don't stand there, we can grab you through the thing. Oh. Shut it, Emily! Move! Oh. Fucking hell! I don't know about anyone else, but my fucking heart is going like no one's business. Oh shit me, I'm so sorry. Fucking hell, how is she alive?
Next time it says don't move, I'm not fucking moving on it. Every time it says don't move, I shoot the controller to the right straight away to put it on my leg. So it does so it's balanced. Hence moving it. Kill it up. Oh Emily you're alive. Thank God. I've never said that so much in my life. We're still with Emily, it's not over yet. Bless her. Running for her life. What now? She knew where the captain was. Let her in quick. Hey, the gang's all here. Where the fuck is Matt? I'm, are you alright? I didn't think that I'd make it. You were screaming bloody murder. Okay? You look totally wild. There was something. Where is Matt? Come sit down, sit down. Something's out Did you there. Guys a monster is Wait. Mom? You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I, I don't feel anything. I just need to calm down. It was moving so damn fast. What? I just had to get away. Away from what? There, there was this, this thing, whatever it was. Em, Em, you can relax. Josh was messing with You're us. You're not listening to me. Em, can you tell us exactly what happened? I am trying to tell you. We were climbing up the tower and it, it fell. The whole tower just fell right into the mines. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What mines? There are these mine shafts all over, running under everything. When the tower fell, we ended up down there. I don't understand. The tower fell? How'd it fall? I, I was walking down there in the mines, and it was dark, and I found this pile, and there was Beth's head. Wait, what? Beth's head. I found oh it. Oh, my God. What the fuck? Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. I think they fell down there. Oh, Jesus Christ. But the worst part is I don't think that Hannah died, like, from the fall, not right away. Wait, what? What do you mean? I don't know, I feel like she was down there, like, starving to death for weeks when we were all up here looking for her, and we had no idea. Jeez, that's horrible. Listen, in in the tower, there was there was a radio, and it Hello, Lady to Saber, good someone, to see you. that was right when the tower collapsed. Welcome along. Em, you made it. Oh, God, yeah, yeah, Mike. <sighs> what about Matt? We're trying to figure that out. Yeah, and then there was this monster that was chasing her. I... She's all messed up, guys. Emily? Hey, Em? Whoa. Who the fuck can that be? Josh. Jess. Maybe Matt? It's not Jess. Sorry, man, but who is it? I don't know. We should check it out. I got your back. Let's not remind ourselves that, you know, we killed Jess yesterday. Already, whoever it is is probably gone by now. I, unless you want me to take the gun. No, no, no. I think that's less good. You do the door. I got the gun. He's still there. He's, he's not gone. You can see him. <laughs> Hold on there. Hold on there, mister. Freeze. Ah, oh, what? All right, all right. Just take it easy, Grandpa. Okay, everybody, just calm down. Nah, just move over there. Go on, move. Let me say what I came to say. I'm here to tell you what you're up against being back on this mountain. You should never have returned. I don't know why you did after what happened last year. You mean with Hannah and Beth? Yeah, how could you know without being involved? Or responsible. You hold on to your horses. I don't take kindly to you kids coming up here to my mountain. Your mountain? Huh? I'm sure the Washingtons would be very surprised to hear that. <laughs> mountain don't belong to me, it's true. But it don't belong to the Washingtons. This mountain belongs to the Wendigo. <laughs> Who? What's he talking about? The hell's a Wendigo? Let's hear him out. Not like we have a choice. Now, I'm only gonna tell you this once. It doesn't matter to me if you believe it or not. I got reasons I wanna get it off my chest. See? I told you. He's guilty as shit. Guilty as something. Shut up, Mike. There is a curse that dwells in these mountains. Should any man or woman resort to cannibalism in these woods, 
the spirit of the Wendigo shall be unleashed. Oh, crap. <laughs> They said it again. The movie could the, the quote of the game like it a movie. Uh, hey, get the party popper. Oh, no, no, he, he can't be. We, we were just with him. A lot can happen quickly on this mountain. No, I'm gonna go get him. You can't go out there, Chris. I'm supposed to be his best friend, and, and, and I let him down. No, he let you down, Chris. He let all of us down. I don't care. I'm going to get him. Then I'll go with you. I don't need your help. And going alone is suicide. Fine. The rest of you, get down to the basement. Be safe. Don't go outside again until we're back. You don't seem to understand the magnitude of the situation. Well, I'm going to get Josh, aren't I? No, I'm going to get Josh. You're going to help me. Do you understand? Uh, yeah, I... So. You need to follow me and do everything I tell you. Friendly bloke. What's the worst that can happen? Going with some random stranger and his flamethrower gun. This is the end. You point towards the thing you want to kill. I know how to use a shotgun, man. No, you don't. What? How do you know? Trust me, I know. Hey, come back safe. Oh, hey, finally. I, uh, see you soon. It's got a job on. So, so tell me, you're the expert on these things. Uh, what's uh? The blood just rushed to his trousers, what's snake. What's the guy got to know? You just be careful. You follow my lead. Okay, boss. So, how many times do I have to shoot it with the shotgun before it's dead? Well, you'll be shooting it a long time. You, you mean this thing won't even kill it? No, it'll slow it down. Well, how do you kill it? They don't like fire. I don't like fire. They fear it. And it can kill them. If you have to. Their skin is like... It's like tough armor. Unless you burn it off first. Well, what are these things like? I mean, are they just crazy unpredictable, or... I mean, can you figure out what they're gonna do? Well... They adhere to some pattern. Like any animal. Or human. Why are we just still in the like mountain? Can we not move? Got okay. schedules. Well, they only hunt at night. Oh. Why? I didn't ask. Uh, pro Wendigo tips. Like if I rub garlic all over me, they won't be able to smell me or something. Uh, they'll still smell you. Go, go like this that. way, dude. I can't see you if you're standing still. It's like toads. <laughs> Sight is based on changes of movement in their field of vision. So if I don't move, I, I'm, I'm basically invisible. Yeah. Well, I wouldn't recommend testing it out. Unless you have no other choice. I believe we've already lived through that one. I think we came up this way earlier. Ah, crap. If yep. these things, uh, Wendigos, are or, or were human, do they, do they still have some aspect of humanity? Them? Well, they retain certain things. I mean, is it really right to kill them? And maybe they could be cured. Or... <laughs> they surrender human rights the moment they eat one another. There's no cure. There's no redemption. I, I, I mean, if they're still human, I don't know if it's right to hurt them. When you're staring one in the face, it's them 
for you. You feel free to take the high road. You won't be on it for long. Oh. We certainly took Josh a fucking long way away, didn't we? Poor bastard. While they're trekking up the mountain, I will do my move stretch. Redeemed by Stitch, greatly appreciated, thank you very much. I ideally do need to move actually. I'm really uncomfortable while I'm playing. My PlayStation is connected to a tiny Italian. So I can't sit comfy on the sofa and play, I have to sit perched on the edge of the bed. Can we not go in the house? That'd be a no, Damn it! <laughs> Damn it! What are you stopping? Okay, he's he's gone. Damn it! What happened? Uh oh. Ah, uh, he's gone. We're too late. Shh. Right now. We gotta find Josh. He can still be out there. <laughs> First, the Wendigo. He'll render you immobile. And then he strips the skin off of your entire body, piece by piece. And then he keeps you alive and aware and feasts on your organs, one piece at a time. What a nice time. story. Yeah, I didn't need to end twice. Let's get the fuck out of here. Fucking running. Yep, don't run into the tree. Oh, oh, oh he did his ankle in. Classic. We'll buy the fucking cherry gun. How many of these fuckers are there? Well, she's sat at the door, personally waiting for me to return. Uh, there's, there's a dude. Oh, there's Josh. Personally being dragged face first through the snow. Cheery, eh? I hope no one's eating their tea. So there right Apologies. Now. Understatement of the night. Chris, where's the flamethrower guy? Uh, yeah, he, uh... He didn't make it? No. What happened? The thing, it, uh, tore him apart. Right in front of me. Oh, God. All right. These are all the doors? Yeah. Are you sure? What are you looking for? One question is, where the fuck out. is Matt? Mike, he didn't I die, did he? I don't think that's a good idea. Would I don't remember him dying. Right, right here until dawn. At least we're safe down here. Oh, yeah? I'll wrap so up where the little fuck is he with a bow on top for that thing to tear us apart on Christmas morning. People will come for us in the morning. You don't Because if so Matt's sure. still alive, we pretty that much got a whole squad happen, right? still on the go. Yeah, I, I mean, right? 
Well, you can wait. I'm leaving. Mike, wait. there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's got to have it. Josh? One of his dirty little tricks. Great, great. If that fucking thing got a hold of Josh, then we're shit out of luck. I don't know, Mike. It's possible. What's possible? It may have taken him down to the mine. What? I saw some horrible stuff down there. I think it's where that thing lives, and... Huh. Em, what? Fuck it. I'm gonna get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. What, we what is all that? So, that old guy's bag. Is that a map? <gasps> that guy was prepared for anything. <laughs> Not quite. What is this place? Oh, my God. Wait, wait, wait. What is that? I was down there. It was horrible. You were? There had been a cave-in in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. Oh, my God. Some of them survived, but, like, 15 of them didn't make it. There was this reporter, and I think he figured out there had been some, like, big cover-up going on. I found these plans. They knew the mine was a death trap, but they let the miners keep working anyway. And I'm not sure what it means, but I found this chair. Dried blood all over the place, like somebody had been tortured. Michael, I'd like to maybe focus on how we're gonna get the fuck out of here, please. I'm just saying, it's weird how much crazy shit's gone on up here. What's weird is that there's a tunnel leading from the lodge to the sanatorium, see? That's how I got back here. I saw this when I was down there. That's where it lives. Um. Um, what is the, huh? What is that? Ash. Um, oh my god, oh my god, it's, oh it's my nothing. god. It's oh nothing. No, it just, it, oh it no, bit it me and. It bit you? What bit you? The, the, the Wendigo. The what? It's nothing, really. It's when not did you get deal, bit? Okay? Shit. It doesn't hurt anymore, really. It's, Emily, no. It's not that bad. Em, if that thing bit you. This I, game I has done me over a good fine. time. Are you? Yes, Emily, at least let us check it out. Emily, if the Wendigo bit you, you could turn into one of those things. Oh, that's ridiculous. He said it was from eating each other. Remember, he said oh, that. What, is that how it worked? Yes, it happens. If it bit you, you're going to turn into one, and then you're going to turn on us. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You can't be down here with us. What? Mike. You got to go. Are you kidding me? You're putting us all in danger. Like hell I am. Emily, you can't stay here. Mike, just cool your head over. Mike was about to leave a minute ago. Like you ain't fucking taking Emily, Emily anywhere. Emily's standing in the basement. I don't want to say it again. Oh, Chris, Guys, you can go away, bro. Door's right here. Yep, see you later, Mike. What are you I am going? I'm you do this voluntarily. No, Emily, oh, no. Oh, no, you're just making yourself feel better about sending me to my death since you know there's a Wendigo out there ready to rip me to pieces like it did with... Okay, oh my God, will you just go? Go, get out of here! Uh, they're all turning on Emily. This is... Whoa, okay. Whoa, 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 <laughs> fucking gun down, you crazy down. bastard. You're gonna shoot? Like me? This is the safe room, M. Please. It is not safe as long as you're in it. No. Not for us. No, don't do that. I'm really sorry. Put the gun down, you dickhead. Keep the book or something. Don't do it. Fuck, I can't do this. Good lad, well done. You did the right thing. Let me pull it in you, you little prick, for killing my fucking Emily. Maybe. Fucking hell, what's going on here? Shit. When did she get fuck, bit? Fuck. What is this bullshit? They just don't want to keep anyone alive in this game. Keep an eye on her. If you see anything weird, you guys know what to do. Yeah. No one leave. Okay? It's not safe out there. So why does he I'll get to leave? Soon. And where the fuck is Matt? I bet Jess is still alive. Oh, they've all turned on Emily. Look at them all. Don't trust her. Relationship of Mike and Ashley's really I turbulent. I thought that, that he was going to help us. Is a flamethrower, dude? Now we don't have a chance. 
No, but it just means we've got to be tough. We've got to do this on our own. I don't know if I can. Cannibalism. Only a few men have dared to hunt the Wendigo. I am the only man who this has ever... A little OCD. I was reading that. <clears throat> Keep them under control. Heed these words or it should be your death and your death will not be the last. The Wendigo must be contained. The Wendigo grows out of cannibalism when a human is desperate and craves food. Trapped on the mountain in the fierce winter storms when he has eaten nothing for many days, the Wendigo spirit will begin to possess him. Even the strongest man is weak to it. He will kill without remorse. Often those companions who have travelled with him. He will eat the flesh raw from the corpse. I have seen this happen many years ago. A craving for flesh that cannot be sated, and the chance be the sorry the change I can't even read. The eyes turn first and become milky and white. Then the teeth become longer like fangs. The creature grows and the skin is pulled taut across the bones. Mm -hmm. There was a tribe that lived in the mountains. The Cree. The shamans. There's a lot of history to Can this. Can you stop while I'm reading? Seriously. Thank you. The tall creature born in ice. The tribe respected the mountain and all the animals which lived on it. The mountains became sacred to the Cree. Every animal became sacred. Also, the Cree believed it was bad luck to harm an animal on the mountain and would hunt elsewhere. In 1893, the miners arrived. They found tin and later traces of radium. They mined deep into the sacred mountain. The Cree said that the mountain cried out and the spirit was released. This is how you kill it. I'm not going to read it or I'll do the shorthand. It cannot see stillness. It says that because the Wendigos are mutated from humans, when they hunt us, they know how to perfectly mimic their prey. Every time. So, it cannot see stillness. If you keep totally still, the Wendigo will not be able to see you. The skin and flesh are hard or armour. Cannot be cut or stabbed, even bullets. A shotgun will keep them at bay. I've killed six Wendigos. Knives or bullets will not harm them. Use a flamethrower. But try not to kill them. Killing a Wendigo should be the last resort. Death release the Wendigo spirit into the air. He's got traps. Let's try some in the cages. The traps were baited with human limbs on those who have no further news for them. The bite is harmless. I have been bitten, but I did not change. The only way to eat the flesh of another, there is no other way. See? Oh. Harmless. She's not going to turn. Oh, no, 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 what? No, no. What is it? What does it say? Emily's fine, everybody. Get the fucking balloons and bunting out. She is fine. It says that... The bites... It, if it bites you, it's not infectious. It doesn't do anything. Yes, okay, Emily. Sorry, I'm sorry, what did yes, you say? Emily. Um, it says she'll be okay. It says what? You're gonna be fine. Fine? Michael almost shot me. Is that he fine? Didn't shoot you. And this bitch almost let him. Hey, that's not fair. She was scared. I'm the one who's scared. I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Emily. I didn't know what was going to happen. There's None of us know. There's no and the turmoil There's begins no again. Emily, please just try to understand. Never be fucking harmless, this group. Bitch. <laughs> I'm sorry. Fucking hell, we didn't so, see that so, coming. I'm so, so sorry. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. We've got to get the mic. Now. Where did Mike go? What was Mike's plan? To be an absolute dickhead and go out and try and be a hero. Oh, Joshua. You should have listened to me. Because of your choices, people have died. I don't know which is worse, actively triggering events that lead to someone's death, or passively allowing a tragedy to occur. 
because you couldn't lift a goddamn finger to help someone else. Remember last year, huh? How you left your poor sisters to die? You did nothing to help them. Paralyzed by your own self-centered fear, while a real threat was closing in. No, it's all about you, Josh. It's always all about you. Your game has gone terribly wrong. And your friends, like your sisters, have deserted you. You're all alone. Can you feel how cold your loneliness has become? Huh? Why did you hurt them? Joshua, why did you hurt them? Well, they didn't hurt you, Joshua. Not intentionally. They made a stupid mistake, and a terrible tragedy befell your sisters. They did not intend for that to happen. It just did. And they were sorry at least until you subjected oh, them you to your Oh, you missed it. Just that Emily's fine. She's not going to die from the bite. Huzzah. Let's hope that it's not too late for a tone. And Emily bitch slapped Ashley. Your friends, if they still are your friends, can to the floor. Something worse than death itself. 